Grace Kitchens, in association with the Culinary Federation of Jamaica, presents the Chef's Invitational Challenge on Creative Cooking. Eight chefs, one goal, to create the most exciting new recipes using Grace Convenience Foods and local produce, and to be the top chef of the challenge. Now, meet today's chefs and your host, Macy Miller. Welcome to the grand finals of the Chef's Invitational Challenge. Competing tonight for the top prize of $50,000 and the Champions Trophy are Chef... Carl Thomas from the Lillian's Restaurant, University of Technology, Jamaica. And... Chef Marvin Robinson from Ronil Hotel. Okay. Chef Carl Thomas, what are you preparing for us this Well, um, today um, I'm keeping the dish a little bit simple. I'm doing uh, Grace Cassava Chicken. I'm going to be doing bacon bits with uh, cinnamon plantain mash and stuffed inside of the chicken breast. Then I'm going to coat it with the cassava chips and then pan fry it. What are you cooking for us, Chef? The Grace Lemon Tea with a lobster stew. Okay. And now introduce the panel of judges. First, Mrs. Paulette Roden. Mrs. Roden is a certified professional chef and the director of Crimson Dawn Limited. Chef Steve Saw is the executive chef at Half Moon Hotel and also a Vice President of the Culinary Federation of Jamaica. And next to him we have Dr. Janet Dyer, the General Manager of the Runaway Bay Heart Hotel and Training Institute. Please proceed to your workstations, gentlemen. The challenge begins now. Chef, what are you doing over here? Well, um, I see. I'm going to be cooking some Grace spaghetti pasta because yeah. I want those to be done and out of the way very soon. Over here, Chef, I see you're working with lobster. I'm just cleaning up my lobster right here. Tell us about what you have boiling over here, Chef. Some Grace cock soup. Mmm. Okay. You diced um, pumpkin first and now I see you working with Coca, Chef. Actually putting both of them together in a mash. Knife skills at its best. Well, the pumpkin, I'm going to boil it to um, reduce the starch content and also the stain, I mean, and also to have it soft so I can stop it in the chicken. What are you going to do with I'm that? Just roasting it up. Okay, roasting tomatoes, I think. Mm -hmm. Chef, you have planted chips there and you are making. Uh, Actually, some cassava chips oh, in cassava This is what I'm going chips. to be yes. using. Tell us what you're doing there, Chef. I'm just stirring the lot to keep it straight. Okay. Well, Chef, now you're working with okras, yes. lady fingers, eh? Yeah, they're actually going to be going with my carrots and vegetables. You're adding rice to that, Chef? Yes. And the roasted tomatoes to the sauteed onions. It's a little salt, one or two much. Seasoning the lobsters, that's enough salt. And the is boiled, Chef. Yes, amazing. Just to cool off a little bit. How long will you have the lobster in the pan for? Less than five minutes. And the, the cocoa and the pumpkin mix that's boiled and you're draining it. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes. What's that you're adding, Chef? It's Grace lemon tea, ginger lemon tea. You're chopping bacon, Chef. Yes, um, I'm going to yeah. Yeah, render them off. So you peel the orange and now you're doing thin slices. And you're using the Grace cock soup stock All right. with the rice. I'm working on some spaghetti pasta for garnish. Okay. I'm just um, boil them a little bit. Yeah. And I'm just going to tie them together and fry them afterwards. Okay. We're transferring the lobster to a baking pan. Chef So, I invite you to join me in the kitchen to see what the chefs are doing. And Chef, I believe they chefs. have used about 15 minutes of their preparation time. 15 minutes time. is yes. gone, yes. How's the rice coming on, Chef? It's beautiful. Okay, good, good. What's that you're pouring in, Chef? A little bit of heavy cream, okay. as usual, to give it okay. some lightness, but not too much because it's going to be a stuffing. If it's too light, it's going to just run out of the chicken when it's cut. But the bacon bits is added to the cream plantain. So you have drained the boiling water from the carrots and okra, and you've transferred them to icy cold water. Right? Yes. Okay. And it goes by a fair tradition. Okay, Charlie. thanks, Chef. What's that you have in the pan, Chef? Uh, I have some grease jerk. Seasoning. Okay. Water is added to it. No, actually, it. this is a little bit of white wine. So to the to the jerk seasoning mm -hmm. and white wine mix, you've just added some. Yeah, heavy added a little bit of heavy cream. It's a little jerk is a little bit spicy. Yeah. You don't yeah. want it to be burning the customers. Not mouth, at so all. Not add a little bit of richness to the sauce. Not itself. at all. 
You are transferring this mixture to the blender. What's your next step, Chef? I'm just gonna get it smooth. What's that you added a while ago, Chef? A little wine. A little white wine, right? Yeah. You're working with chicken breasts, Chef. Yes. yes. I'm actually making an incision mm -hmm. at the tip of the breast to yes. put the stuffing in. Not too much salt though, because I'd have a little bacon in there. Oh yes, right. You have to watch the amount of salt to use, yes. yes. You're using a forcing bag, Chef. You're going to... I'm going to use that to, to stuff the chicken. Okay. Um, just in, put it in the incision yes. and just pipe. So the meat the So you're using egg. What's the role of the egg in this dish? Well, um, I'm going to be coating the chicken breast, so I need the egg as a um, binding agent for okay. Okay. chicken. Mm -hmm. We're going to dry um, the chicken, okay. then to the egg mixture, then to the cassava. Okay. 30 minutes have gone, guys. You transfer the lobster to the? To the lemon broth. Okay. okay. What's that you're doing here, Chef? I'm just getting some lemon in this. Okay. Some camelata. Lemon zest, yeah. Remind me of the mix again. Tomatoes, finely chopped tomatoes, some... Parsley. Parsley. Lime. Lime. Tomatoes. Grace jack mackerel. Interesting. Chef, may I invite you to come and see what is happening in your kitchen? Yes, yes. You invite me a lot. <laughs> this is very exciting. Very exciting. The final two. Yes, the final two, Chef. There's some excellent dishes oh, coming up. Yes. What talent you have here, Chef. Mm -hmm. oh, fantastic. Yes. So you put the, pour the sauteed seasonings on the cocoa yeah. and, and pumpkin. Interesting mm -hmm. way of using a Pumpkin and chocho, um, pumpkin and coca chef. Chefs, you have five minutes of cooking time left. Thanks, chef. So now the chicken breasts are finished cooking. You're draining them. Yes, and also it gives the chicken breast some time to kind of rest before we actually cut it, because we don't want it, the chicken breast to break up when we, when we do. Melting some margarine. Using that to saute onions. What are you using there, chef? Sweet potatoes, potatoes. is it? Make some garnish. Yes, okay. You put some the, the, the yeah. potato strings in some cold water. So once I get them very firm, eh? No, I don't want to get them. Okay. Change its color. Melting some margarine there, chef. Yeah. And adding some onions to that. 20 seconds to go, chefs. 20 seconds to go. Ten seconds to go, chefs. Five seconds. Four seconds. One. Please turn off the burners. You have five minutes in which to plate. Five seconds to go. Four, three, two, one. Please stop working. My word, time is up. <laughs> Be back with us on Friday evening, same time, same station, and find out who will take home the top prize. Grace Kitchens, in association with the Culinary Federation of Jamaica, presents the Chef's Invitational Challenge on Creative Cooking, taking Grace Convenience Foods to a new level. Who will be the top chef of the challenge? Join CBM TV for Creative Cooking every Tuesday and Friday at 7.50 p.m.